My videos have fully optimized titles, descriptions, and tags. Why don't they rank higher? In this video, you'll discover seven reasons why YouTube search results are not showing and how to fix it. Number one, fewer people are interested in your video's topic. If you create a video on a topic that your audience is not interested in, they're not gonna watch your video, even if you've optimized the title, description, tags, and thumbnail. So how do you choose a topic for your video that you know your audience will be interested in watching? One way to choose a topic that your audience will be interested in is look at the search volume for keyword queries people are entering into the search engines. I use the Chrome extension Keywords Everywhere to get the search volume, cost per click, and competition for a specific keyword phrase. This tool makes it easy to find the exact keywords your audience is looking for. For example, if I enter YouTube search in the YouTube search bar, Keywords Discovery will give me the search volume, cost per click, and competition for these related keyword phrases. This saves me a ton of time analyzing the keyword phrases that my audience is looking for. I also use the Keyword Explorer tool in TubeBuddy to quickly find the keyword that isn't too competitive and has enough search volume to make it worth targeting. If I get an overall score of excellent or very good, then I know that this keyword has a great chance of ranking in the search results. I'll place a link to TubeBuddy in the description below this video. Another reason why your videos don't show up in search is that videos on the same topic are more popular. If you target a very popular keyword phrase, it's gonna be very difficult to rank your video at the top of YouTube search, especially if you're a small channel. Instead, you should target less competitive keyword phrases because they're easier to rank for. Another idea is to choose a different topic that has less competition. Over 500 hours of content are uploaded to YouTube every minute, so they need some ranking system to make it easy for you to find those videos. YouTube does this by sorting through tons of videos to find the most relevant and useful results for your search query. Here's what YouTube says about what's most important when sorting through these search results. At YouTube, we prioritize three main elements to provide the best search results, relevancy, engagement, and quality. Let's take a look at relevance. YouTube says, to estimate relevance, we look into many factors, such as how well the title, tags, description, and video content match your search query. So when you optimize your video, make sure you include that keyword phrase in the title, description, and tags of your video. Also make sure that your thumbnail supports your title and video content. Rhetorius asks, if I have a lot of keyword phrases in my descriptions, will it become less likely for each one to show up in search? If all your keyword phrases are relevant to the content in your video, it will help your video to rank in the search results. Keep in mind there are other factors that contribute to ranking in the search results. Blackout Ultra Motions asks, is it worth using a tags generator? Do tags actually make a difference? Adding tags to your video no longer helps your video get ranked in the search results, but it's still a good idea to add them. More important is including your keyword phrase in the title and description and creating a clickable thumbnail. The next factor that YouTube prioritizes for search is engagement. Let's see what YouTube says. Engagement signals are a valuable way to determine relevance. We incorporate aggregate engagement signals from users. For example, we may look at the watch time of a particular video for a particular query to determine if the video is considered relevant to the query by other users. This means if viewers like your video and remain engaged throughout your video, it's more likely that your video will appear in the search results. Excellent engagement starts with a topic that your viewers are interested in. To keep your viewers engaged, start your video with a strong hook, such as a question or making a bold statement or teasing what's coming up next in the video. You can also reset the attention of your viewers throughout the video by using B-roll, text overlays, transitions, graphics, etc. The other main element that YouTube prioritizes for best search results is quality. Here's what YouTube says about quality. Our systems are designed to identify signals that can help determine which channels demonstrate expertise, authoritativeness, and trustworthiness on a given topic. This means that when you share your video content, all the points that you make should relate to each other to demonstrate your expertise on the subject. Therefore, it's a good idea not to just create a solo video on a particular topic, but to create a series of videos on related topics. This will help the viewer take a deeper dive into your content and get to know, like, and trust the content that you're making for your channel. Keep in mind that search results differ for each user because they're personalized to that user. For example, if I watch a lot of videos about electric bikes on YouTube, then YouTube is gonna recommend more videos on electric bikes in the YouTube search results based upon my personal browsing behavior. Here's what YouTube says. In addition to those three main factors, we strive to make search results relevant for each user, and we may also consider your search and watch history. That's why your search results might differ from another user's search results 
for the same query. That means what I see in the search results for a particular query is going to be different for another user using the same query because they have a different watch history. If you want to view the search results for a particular query that are not based upon your personal browsing behavior or watch history, then use incognito mode. You'll then be able to see the same search results as what other users are seeing. Another reason why your video hasn't shown up in the search results is that you haven't given enough time. Sometimes a video takes weeks, months, or even years to rank on the first page of YouTube, so you have to exert a bit of patience. For example, this video only got 290 views in the first 24 hours when it was first uploaded on February 22nd. Currently, the video has gotten 22,663 views since it was published between February 22nd and August 5th, 2021. It currently receives 329 views every 48 hours. So you can see it may take several months to accumulate views for your video from YouTube search. The Medical Information Channel asks, I use similar relevant methods to add keywords in all my videos, but notice that one particular video seems to show up most on search, so I'm still wondering why that particular one. Some of the factors that may have contributed to this video doing well in YouTube search is the topic, title, thumbnail, relevancy, engagement, and also the browsing behavior of your viewers. Click on the Reach tab and YouTube Analytics for that specific video, then look at the keyword queries under YouTube search and YouTube suggested videos. These keyword phrases are how viewers discovered your video, so make more videos based upon those related keyword phrases. What if you have a small YouTube channel? Can you rank for highly competitive keywords? Watch a video on the screen right now on how to rank for highly competitive keywords on YouTube, even if you have a small channel.